Well, a woman weighing more than 600 pounds is bedridden and suffering some painful bed sores down the backside of her body. Her family is battling an insurance company for equipment that could help her out. And now they're reaching out to CBS 46 to help them get results. Brittany Edney, live in Butts County. And Brittany, what does this family need exactly? Well, Rick, Jennifer Mayfield and her family, they admit point blank, they need a lot of help because finding medical attention that can uh, accommodate this particular situation, it is not an easy task. In fact, they invited us into their home today to kind of just reveal a very private struggle in the hopes that maybe being vulnerable could result in her finally getting the help that she needs because they believe that could mean the difference between life and death for her. We also do want to warn you that some of these images you may see may be a little bit difficult to watch. I can't move. Jennifer Mayfield is bedridden. I, I can't even turn over. And in pain. Over. On a scale of 1 to 10, how much does that hurt? <laughs> 10. More. Yeah, because it's, it's raw. I mean, and there's souls up under there. Her husband, Victor, says they've been waiting a month for her insurance company to send equipment that would help him move her. I mean, because she had to use the bathroom in the bed, and we cannot pick her up and change her. But the provider won't get back to them. So they've turned to CBS 46 to get results. At any time, press one to be connected to the staff member. Yes, please. <laughs> we left messages for her local insurance rep. Her bed sores are so bad that fire and rescue said that they're worried that they might start opening soon. And her primary care doctor to see if they'll accommodate her since traveling isn't an option. That's why we need to see if somebody can make a house visit to kind of come and look at the progression of these sores. But the Mayfield family is worried that time's running out. So I'm not going to abandon my wife, and I don't expect the hospital or nobody else to abandon and not help me with her. You can't just be left to die. I know there's more of a life for me that God's wanting. And so far from all of the calls that I have made today, I have not heard back from anyone, but I am going to be forwarding the link to this story from our website to her insurance provider. It is am better so they can expect my email here shortly. Also, I have also been talking to Dr. Oz's team out of New York. They've been making some calls as well because we want to not only try and get this equipment that Jennifer needs for her, but she also says she is ready for help. She wants to address, address the weight issue, but she does acknowledge that she's likely going to need a lot of specialists, um, people that can help this particular situation. So we are working and doing everything that we can to help her get results and hopefully help this situation get better for her and her family. Reporting live in Butts County, I'm Brittany Yadney, CBS 46 News. All right, Brittany, keep us posted on that, please.